back to the Auto Lunch Tidbit Show. I'm your host, as always, the doctor to the automotive industry, Mr. Everett J. Talking to you today about one of my ill-fated favorite car companies, Chrysler. Now, they made a lot of bad decisions in their past. When they came out of bankruptcy, they were doing great. They had a lot of amazing products, and they were moving forward. And then they got a tie-up with Daimler. And Daimler kept them from expanding into the luxury marketplace as we compete against Mercedes. And then we get Servius Management Group. And then we get FCA. Fiat Chrysler Association was a bad news situation for Chrysler. Why? Because FCA focused on an individual model basis. They didn't focus on the grand scheme of things. They didn't say, we have the rear-wheel drive platform of the Charger and Challenger. Let's put the Alfa Romeo and Maserati products onto that same platform so we can make more money off the similar products. They decided to make their vehicles dedicated. Similar to the reason why the Wagoneer and Grand Wagoneer took so long for Jeep to bring out. Now, with the brand new Stellantis Corporation, things are moving forward and Stellantis is stating the fact that they want to build products upon products. So could this be new good news for Chrysler as it has a 10-year waiting list? Well, nine years now of life expectancy left. Can it form an alliance with both DS and Lancia to keep its momentum going? Or will Chrysler assume the fate of its ill-fated Plymouth brand? Only time. We'll tell.